Hello everyone. I just wanted to come over here real quick and I want to introduce you to a new web design that I'm doing called a parallax design. And within this parallax design, what you do is you scroll down and here's my website right here as an example. Um, we mouse over top of here and you have all kind of different little call to actions, you know, where you can tweet me or whatever the case may be. But when you click services, it bounces you right down to that services section. As you notice right here, it's like a window, a website like behind another website and all kind of different cool things going on all kind of great things going on right over here is the portfolio and here's my portfolio here's my wife's website um, you kind of brings you over here it shows you the website in reference to um, all kind of things nested inside here as far as some type of call to action uh, you know we don't miss out on you know the taking advantage of having a blog right over in here. Here's our different blog posts and things of that nature. So this parallax is a new design, um, keeping you relevant on the web. Um, one thing I wanna definitely show you from a new discovery that I just made today. Right over here on my website, I have some affiliate marketing information in reference to GoDaddy. So you can come over here and you can obtain a domain, save money, all kind of great different stuff. But here's the thing I really wanna show you that's amazing, that um, I consider GoDaddy one of the big boys in this web space in the web world. If you notice, they have a Parallax website as well that really complements my website. How genius. Now, here's the thing. Um, this is where the web is moving to today. The web is moving to this new space of a Parallax website that is going to give you all the information right here on one page in reference to um, a call to action. People have very short attention spans when it comes to the internet. Um, you don't want them to come to your website, your message being over here on the fourth tab. You know, for instance, mine is right here over here in the portfolio as far as examples and sites that I've done in the past in reference to, you know, you considering me for your next website project. Um, you know, I want you to definitely experience that and see that. If they got to go in this tab and in that tab and in this tab and in this tab, um, sometimes they get exhausted. But one thing that really happens with the website that I'm trying to create for you, um, that I will put together for you, is the fact that they're always curious of what's next and they, con they, they can't stop scrolling, you know. And so they're going to take in the full experience and they're going to be curious and they're going to look around and see what you have going on. And they're not going to leave not one stone unturned in reference to your website, okay. So um, I just wanted to definitely show you that. I want to show you where all the big boys are in this space as far as uh, doing this website. There's a few more big boys I definitely want to introduce you to and show you that is using this design as well. So um, if you want to, there should be some type of link attached to this video um, below this video. Um, click it and I will show you the rest of the tutorial, the full tutorial in reference to um, who else is using this design to stay relevant in the web today. Now over here on this website right here, this parallax scrolling, uh, you know, 40 different examples and tutorials on reference to people that are using this website right here. What I went on ahead and I just did, I kind of got the initiative to get the pages loaded and get them prepared and ready for you is I got a few tabs right here I want to kind of dance you through. Now over here is uh, a Michael Jordan website uh, with Nike. And the beautiful thing about it is that, you know, over here is like a little timeline as far as where you are in reference to the website and the shoe. So here is the site right here. And, you know, as you scroll down, you just keep scrolling down. You'll see where, um, you know, this shoe right here comes together, all kind of different things, um, all kind of different information moving around. It's not a lot of reading, you know, um, here you can download something right here, you know, really cool design in reference to, um, you know, creating that memory. You know, uh, one thing that I think is genius is that, you know, downtown Atlanta, Georgia, where I live, um, you know, Chick-fil-A has an advertisement that they've purchased and they keep in reference to, you know, marketing their great marketing tactics. And there's no Chick-fil-A nowhere near, you know, that that billboard downtown Atlanta. But what they do is they stay relevant. They stay on people's mind in reference to if you're ever hungry, you're thinking about that cool advertisement. Once you come to this website right here, you're never going to forget it ever. OK, so that's their whole entire ideal in reference to the creativeness that they did in reference to the shoe. OK, um, anytime I see this shoe on somebody's foot, I'm thinking about this website. OK, um, right over here is Smoky Bones and over here on their website, what they did was um, they have the parallax design as well. Um, we go to the very top here. 
um, all my websites are at the bottom because this is my second time I've done this tutorial so the burger kind of comes apart to show you all the ingredients and it comes together nice and slow to make this beautiful burger to entice you make your mouth water you see the the beer glass empty out as you start to scroll down as if you drank the the the, the beer there uh, their application all kind of different things you can look up um, you know your city state right in this section of the website very very cool um, right over here I want to show you um, uh, this bag here this bag is going to kind of you know show you every angle of this bag so you're not curious of what this what side of the bag looks like or what the top looks like it moves around as you scroll down and it kind of gives you some you know handwritten um, very intimate personal um, text right over in here um, that is very very creative and cool in reference to showing you um, different things about the bag um, what the bag involves what the bag does you know some close-ups of the bag and as you scroll you know you start to unzip or zip whatever way that thing is going there in reference to this bag and then at the very end of it you meet the designer you read his information and then it takes you back to the bag as far as um, what they have going on and boom you know here's what you pay for it you buy it view the collection you can click this to go to a different place or whatever you know within here's the iPad case right here very cool um, right over here this website is a um, a game that's being introduced to the App Store I'm also in the space to where I am developing um, a splash page a landing page in reference to whatever product that you have going on in reference to if you're coming out with a new game a new application a new webinar a new product um, something you want to introduce to the world um, and you need a website to um, you know to to represent that um, I was have and I have been fortunate enough to be a part of uh, John Legend's um, camp in reference to um, his web design and his websites um, the way it works in the entertainment business for every single for every album for every video that they come out with they always have a website to complement it so um, within this game right here or within your products or within your whatever you have going on as far as a new webinar um, you know a new YouTube channel whatever the case may be um, you know I would be happy to, to to design and put together a landing page for you as they have done here to introduce their new product they're introducing to the app store as far as people being involved in you know um, their 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 website and their application and like I said once again it's something that's definitely going to stay relevant to where it's always going to stay on people's mind um, also adding videos to your websites to where the video pops out where you're never leaving the actual home page there you're never leaving the home page you're never leaving the website to experience the videos and all that great stuff right over in there um, right over here is a music website um, as you scroll down you can kind of see you know all kind of different things happen here in reference to um, things moving around um, information to read and everything um, I'm more of in the creative space I'm not too big on reading a lot of different stuff and people's websites so um, this thing over here you know uh, is very creative you see they won all kind of different awards which is really cool um, here's another website over here where you can kind of click the tab here um, like some of the examples that I've already shown you I'm not going to spend a lot of time here um, because you know you, I just wanted to show you the mechanics of the way the website moves around okay now this website right here is the one I really wanted to get to that I really really like and then here's a message that that's really strong and I really want you to take this home the fact that this website is all about literature there's no pictures on this website for me that's a freaking nightmare because I don't necessarily like to read a lot of stuff I like to skim stuff and kind of you know just read all the important stuff but I don't want to read you know a whole entire website I don't like to read a lot of stuff on the internet you know what I'm saying it gives me a headache but this right here the way they design this thing it makes me want to read the words are actually pictures to me um, this is inviting to read I am you know they have captivated by doing something that people don't necessarily like to do on the web and that's read stuff okay um, no pictures but the words become the picture is that beautiful or what they got me to read stuff they got me to read their information and you see why this website right here one side of the day um, very big credentials in reference to uh, the web space all the websites in this world all the beautiful websites in this world and you know this site is um, website of the day for a reason um, here's another website 
right here with the parallax um, this one right here it moves right to left versus up and down um, if you go to website candy.com you will see in my portfolio you just click portfolio it'll take you right there you will see pebbles if you don't know who pebbles is if you're 25 years and older you possibly might know who she is if you're 25 years and younger you're about to be introduced to her in reference to who she is um, but she's a music artist and I was you know fortunate enough to build a website for her um, within her website it moves right and left as well well, however, it was built on Flash. This right here and all these designs that I build are built in a format called HTML5. It's like Flash's sexy cousin, okay? Um, Flash is the old, you know, ugly mule nowadays versus um, this is um, what's going on on the web. This is where the relevancy is in reference to keeping your clients interested and getting the full effect. You see they won all kinds of awards and you see where the popcorn is coming at you in a three dimensional space. Believe it or not, I just ducked, okay? Not really. But anyway, um, here's the last thing I want to show you. Here's his kid um, today, which is, um, you know, 326, 2012 for whenever you're watching this video. Um, this kid right here, um, created an application called Slumly and what he did was he uh, made this application in reference to all the, all the applications that have been made on the App Store and there's so many beautiful applications why did this one right here get sold for 30 million dollars to Yahoo why was Yahoo so interested because he made an application that just gives you the prudent relative um, important information of all the articles that's going around the web very 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 ingenious this is exactly what I'm doing in reference to you and your website is by making it relevant making you making your website relevant to where they're getting the full message um, and a Twitter type of format you know to your readers to the full experience for your website to make sure they take in the full message and they take exactly all the way you in and they breathe all the way you in in reference to getting the full experience now in the old web space um, I've seen some beautiful websites on the web um, that are just wonderful however you know um, by the fourth tab I'm exhausted I'm done I'm tired you know I, I don't have time to look at the website anymore I'm too busy thinking about I haven't said happy birthday to a certain friend on Facebook yet and my attention span is no longer in the website even though it's great information and I'm thinking about webs um, Facebook and I'm headed over to Facebook to say happy birthday to my friend okay you don't want to get a person to your website and lose that person by you know over delivering too much information and then not taking in your website the only people who read websites in full are developers the only people who go to every single tab on a website are developers um, there's a probably a website that you go to on a day-to-day -day basis where there's some hidden stuff that you probably have not experienced yet because you know um, you know you probably only make it to the third page or so you know what I'm saying so um, this is the reason why you want people to take you completely and fully in um, take some action come over here um, right over here in the middle of my website under the services is get a quote and I'll be happy to share with you you share with me your email address as far as getting involved where I can you know give you a quote in reference to a website a landing page a splash page uh, to introduce a new product and be a part of your um, beautiful program that you're bringing forth to the web and I'll be happy to share with you a case study I've done and and how people use Facebook um, the mechanics of how people use Facebook and how you can counteract and use that in reference to um, definitely having people take action within your website and why people would take action within your website um, so um, thanks for hanging out for this kind of a long tutorial however I'm sure you've learned something new I know you're thinking about some things and I look forward to hearing from you alright thank you bye bye